back to Atlanta, Georgia. I haven't been here in a long time. I had my stroke, but I'm better. Yeah. That was good. All kinds of good. And this next song I'm going to do is for, it's one for my new CD. And it's called When a Man is Sleeping, a Woman is Thinking. <laughs> you sung that was excellent is that something you you said you wrote it yourself i wrote that song i wrote it about my last husband <laughs> so when can we expect to uh if we wanted a copy of that i have it with me okay all right so we'll do so can you tell those that real uh because you sing the blues can you tell us a little bit about yourself i'm from memphis tennessee and i work for bb king who is my godfather i've been with bb uh since i was 19. And I've been performing at his club for 20 years now. And that's why I sing it every day. And, but you know, God is good. Let me come back. So how did you feel when, uh, when you were asked to, to be here at the trumpet at this award? That was one of the greatest blessings I ever received was a phone call from Mr. Zanona telling me to come back after being out two years. And she, when she called me, I said, oh, yeah. So I dropped everything. Before I let you go, what are some of your goals? What do you plan on doing in the next year or two? Just to continue to get better okay. and keep getting my awards. Okay. I just got a Lifetime Achievement Award. Excellent. Could you tell us a little bit about that? It's a Lifetime Achievement Award. It's what the, uh, in the black neighborhood, mm -hmm. when you've done all you can do mm -hmm. and all that you're supposed to do, they give you an award. And they gave me a Lifetime Achievement Award Excellent. for all of my endeavors. And I work for senior citizens as well as the American Breast Cancer, and I work for the American Stroke Association. And I'm the spokesperson. Excellent. Well, listen, I want to thank you so much. It's been an honor. Thank, thank you, you very much. May not be tomorrow, may not be next week. If you think you got one more, you all turn the other to When you got it coming, you can never tell.